Tehran resemble a battleground. These pictures shown on state television show clashes between anti-government protesters and the police. Broadcaster says they were filmed on Saturday. They also say 10 people were killed and more than 100 wounded. Iranian police officers appear to be a target. This footage apparently shows at least two officers under attack after being forced off their motorbikes. The scenes are significant because they took place just a day after Iran's supreme leader issued a warning to protesters. Ayatollah Ali Khamenei gave his full support to President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad. And he said there would be serious consequences if they continued to protest about the recent election result. Iranian newspapers have now also published a letter from Iran's police chief to the opposition leader, Mihussein Mousavi. It warns that officers will decisively confront any further unrest. The results of an investigation into alleged voting irregularities will be announced at the end of the week. But Iran's foreign minister told a group of foreign diplomats he's confident about the result. It is very unlikely to see any displacement, disruption, or any vote rigging or irregularities. It reaches close to nothing. President Ahmadinejad also accused the West of interfering. He was filmed addressing clerics, but one senior cleric wasn't among them. Grand Ayatollah Ali Montazari called for three days of national mourning for the protesters who died. The dissident said resisting people's demands was religiously prohibited. His comments highlight the continuing divide in Iran, and many believe a government crackdown to end the protests may now be imminent.